<laughs> Hello, everyone. We're on the internet. Hello, we're live on internet.com. Bloody oh, it's hell. exciting, isn't it? Beaming it's... directly to people's living rooms. I, see, I mean, you know, I assume most people watch our streams on their phone, but maybe when it's an event like this, it's like, no, let's get the big, t- let's wheel the big telly out. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Maybe big telly on wheels. <laughs> Uh, Dave's yeah. not here yet. You, you may have noticed that's not a technical error. He's just not here. We've had to make an executive decision. Yeah, and, um, he's off the show. It was unfortunate. Yeah. He's good. But... <laughs> Pending <laughs> an investigation. Yeah. <laughs> We've had to do it. Yeah, um, no, Dave, but, it, but, it, but he'll be here. But anyway, we're here for the, yeah, the big, the biggie, arguably the biggest event of the year. <laughs> Matt, don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> We don't it, know, right? We obviously we know the the four games that are the main focus of this, so no surprises there. No, but then oh God, there's got to be there's got to be something. Yeah, there's there will be. be. There's, there's, there's no way else. there's going to be nothing like at all that's like a surprise. There's yeah. got to be a couple. I mean, it's is it weird that I'm more excited to see what the format is than the actual content? <laughs> Have they learned? <laughs> is it going to be a tight? I mean, to, you know, to be entirely sure. No, I think that's completely reasonable, honestly. I mean, especially considering... considering Matt works in marketing, right? Of course, yeah. that's you know, that's like, professionally interesting, it. if nothing yeah. else. Um, so like, you know, if they have, like, okay, then yeah, because we we don't we just do not cover these events. Have we ever really done a talk show before? Well, because it's they're like... like six hours long, aren't they? Usually, <laughs> so it's like no one's going to do that. So if I did, that'd be that'd be that's okay, big tick, amazing, and then we can I can actually start. This is like another thing I can actually get to look forward to, rather than <laughs> just like I read it tomorrow because I haven't got sixteen hours of my life to waste. Yeah. Um, yeah so a new Forza, I, I'm look, I you know I haven't actually played a Forza motorsport game. Obviously, love the Horizon games. You know, it, it will look stunning. Uh, I'm I'll be up for a, a good looking fun racing game. So I'm interested to see what that's like. If mm-hmm. I'm interested to know if that does look uh, ridiculously. You know, different and or better than say GT7. I mean, it um, should do, right? It should do. Oh, sorry, the Grand Turismo. Sorry, uh, um, no, sorry, I, I thought you, you were going to say you meant Forza Horizon. Horizon. Yeah, because yeah. obviously this is definitely next gen, well, the current gen only, isn't it? Yes. Um, yeah. Plus the you know reduced scope of the tracks, like it's not open world. Um, mm-hmm. So yeah. maybe it'll look really nice. However, oh, I'm sure it will. As a you know, someone who prefers arcade races anyway, mm. I don't know if this is going to do anything for me. That like I, 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 like I'm the person that Horizon is aimed at, so mm. I'm, I'm probably going to be all right. Um, but you know, I'm excited for everyone else. Redfall though, <laughs> Redfall's the one I think that could be interesting. Redfall, yes, that, yeah. 100%. yeah. So Redfall um, is it a Left 4 Dead style game? Or is it not? Haven't they sort of rode back on that? Like it's not yeah. actually like there is co-op, but it's not like it's perfectly playable as just a straightforward campaign, I yeah. believe. It's and it's um, not like just getting from level to level surviving kind of thing. I think mm. it's supposed to be a bit more involved than that, which is um yeah, hopefully nice. I'm out okay. of sync. In what way? It'll probably just fix itself. I'm not uh, yeah. I'm not, not that's worried. what I was that's what I do. <laughs> <laughs> it tends to it just goes in and out, doesn't it's matter. Like if not just get used to it. Yeah, deal with yeah. it. Right. <laughs> uh, sorry, we were missing stuff in the chat here. Um, ben was asking, before the, show, before the show starts, can he ask us, can he use our screen names to give to some Pokemon that will probably die? Is this, this is, the, is this a Nuzlocke run, Ben, that you're doing? It um, is. It is, yeah. Go for it. Yeah. Cool. Yes, please. Uh, yeah. Very happy. I mean, real name or screen name, don't mind. Um. I mean, you guys don't have funny screen names, do you? I know, and it's something I regret, honestly. Is it? Yeah, because I, 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 I never. Well, my, my first email address was like sixteen bit pixel. Nice. Yeah, I, was just like, <laughs> I just never thought of like a name, but I do kind of wish I had from yeah. day one. And now I'm Pretty just so. like, and because like like before Skyrim, every character name in the game was just Matt Murray. That's what I just called my <laughs> if I made a character. So I'm like, okay, so I call myself, you know something weird for like for Skyrim but I'll mm. just I don't know I've never had a cool internet name mm. I mean uh, never yeah, will. I don't know like, too late. it's too late isn't it at this point yeah it would seem yeah it would seem weird it's like hey I'm 40 now there. can you guys start calling me uh, <laughs> <laughs> this lord I'm Smackdown Bomb 67 yeah. you know it's <laughs> pretty good though <laughs> well I, I, I could rebrand on my social channels I guess um, <laughs> so yeah the, the, the Mojang Studios game that's mm-hmm. Minecraft 
It's like a weird. Uh, was it Minecraft Legends or something? It's like a weird yes. sort of strategy one, but you're on. It, do you know what it reminds mm. me of? And I think only James will respond to this. It looks a bit like Kessen. Really? Yeah. Okay. And that you like it's strategy, but you're sort of going around on horseback, mm. sort of directing things around. If I've not got that completely <laughs> wrong, that's quite interesting. <laughs> um. So yeah. But what's? I wonder what the target audience is going to be, because it's like. Yeah. I don't know. I don't want to say Minecraft is played by kids a lot, but it is played by kids a lot. And it's like, is this going to be... I mean, you say it's... that, but it's... it's. I mean, it's been yeah, around but... for long enough, right? That I was going to say, yeah. I mean, people who uh, were kids when it first came out are now adults. Yeah, yeah that's, that's true. <laughs> yeah. Oh, here he I mean, is. It was like 2009, wasn't it? So yeah. I, think, I think we're okay. Right. I think it is pure our age. Hello, David. Yeah. Hello, Dave. Uh, you all right? It's true. It's played by a I'm lot. Right. Yeah. The investigation's right? over. Yeah, all right. You all right? Yeah, I am. I'm, uh... I find it quite funny how big you get for your boots when I'm not on. <laughs> and then how that... See, so you hear that? I come into that's, the chat. Gaffer, and gaffer, 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 watch, watch. Everyone at home watching, I just want you to take note. <laughs> I come into the chat and they were like, you are right, Dave? How are you doing? Like I wasn't here to hear you go, he's off the show. <laughs> he's off the show. Yeah, we've had to... <laughs> he's off the show. And now now look at you. You, you. you fucking act the big man when I'm not about, but now I'm here. Bunch of fucking... Yeah, cool. Oh, yeah, what I can say these days, eh? Oh, I can say these days. Have you got the? Have you got the stream up? The we're on the just the Twitch Xbox channel. Yeah, oh, watch, the Twitch, channel. watch the Twitch one. Okay. Yeah. Did you not see the press release? No. What does it say? Don't they watch this don't on watch Twitch. It's shit. Yeah, they said watch it on on uh, YouTube. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. Well, but... I, I, I saw them say if you want to watching, you know, watch it, then watch it afterwards in 4K. What, watch the rerun later if you want to yeah, see. I'm going to just the... say, yeah, everyone watch this on YouTube. I mean, that would probably piss off Twitch quite a lot. Well, they did say that for starters. Secondly, <laughs> um, we we always watch it on YouTube so we can catch. It. I'm assuming James just wants to watch it on no, Twitch. And this was no, nothing no, to we, do with me yeah, at we all. all. We all went for Twitch and we're magically all in sync. So we're just yeah. sort of stuck you, with it. Oh, so what am I on? I'm on 04, 16, 15, yeah, yeah 14, exactly. Like a yep. couple of seconds that's, behind that's me. Good. That's good. Oh right, couple of seconds behind. Okay, right. that's fine. We could have corrected that on YouTube. Nah. Um, Who gives right. a fuck? <laughs> James, you don't give a fuck because you you give no interest in any technical things ever. <laughs> no, if it works, it Who works. Who gives a fuck? <coughs> the people that do this stuff give a fuck. Well, you didn't give a fuck last night, did you? Fucking around with your stream. Yeah, Whoa. no, I was having Whoa. trouble with it, but what hurt What hurt last night was, he's a fucking idiot, he's a fucking idiot. Then you called me and asked if I'd done the three things that I'd said that I'd done on the on the chat. <laughs> Didn't you saying that? Because I was yeah. getting out of bed well, so that I could come and help you. Don't plug it into your monitor then, just yeah, you know, have it running what, straight out of bed to help you. This, this was bed? early on. Oh, you got to watch the whole bit, it's unbelievable. <laughs> well, Dave, don't plug it into your TV then. I want to plug it into the TV, it makes it easier. Oh, right. That's well, just, I mean, that's just... Yes, it does. <laughs> Wait, what? My laptop screen is here. Then move James. your laptop. It is portable. I mean, do you know that you can oh, move yeah. laptops I'm gonna around, right? I'm going to play the whole screen like this. <laughs> Why did you do that? <laughs> hold on. Sorry, hold on. <laughs> hold on, i got a... It's sliding off my hands. I'm trying to play <laughs> and hold yeah. my laptop up at the same time. Sorry, I, I didn't realise that, you know, you could put it down somewhere. You know, it's like you don't yeah, have to... Yeah, on my desk. Is that, so how, you, is that how you do work, babe? Do you hold your laptop up in the air and then, like, do, like, write on it and no, stuff? Uh, wait, what are you talking about? I'm saying you can move <laughs> it about. It doesn't have yeah. to be in one position. But it's on my desk, James. It's on so? my desk and a laptop seems to be lower when it's on your desk, doesn't it? Yeah, so? So I don't want to play like that. I want to play anyway. I fixed it. Put some books you were underneath saying, it. Have you got? Have you got an output on your TV? <laughs> your monitor? You, you have you got an output on it? No, I said I haven't before you called in. All right. Well, I fixed it you, now. And then yeah, you went. Then That's you, the you, last you, time you I helped you. To say what I was going to suggest. You didn't fucking help yeah, me, just James. Being a prick. He's just, just being a prick. Just, just trying to be laughing. the big man as usual. I'm just laughing. Yeah, at least don't look to your fucking face and not behind your back. I'm just laughing at the idea of the Xbox thing starting and you just carrying on. I mean, <laughs> we like, might as well. This is just... <laughs> I'm fully, fully prepared that this is going to be shit. Dave, I oh, come on. Redfall, Redfall's going to be good. Uh, no, I said I was going to call crawl out of my depression hole, Matt. There's no, there's difference <laughs> got, between I'm being positive. <laughs> and not going negative vibes. Oh, oh sorry, Matt. Okay. But... Fucking hell. It's toxic What's positivity, Matt. Toxic positivity, that is. 
Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to... Look, James fucked me off last night. I can't wait for you to see the clip, Sean, because <laughs> no, it, it, it comes in and suggests that I do exactly what he does, forgetting the fact that I've got a laptop and not a big Mac monitor in front of me. <laughs> so that's how he oh, does so it. Oh, so did he suggest to just play it by what looking at OBS, basically? Yes. Right, okay. <laughs> that's what he wanted me to do. Cool. Yeah, I saw that bit, and then... That's what you wanted me to do. So how did you fix it in? Because I saw that bit where he was telling I me to select uh, audio, uh, the audio input, the capture from OBS. I select, I, I turn monitoring on. Right, yeah, yeah. So it's sort oh, of a okay. workaround. Yeah. But, um, but it worked. Oh, shit. Here we go. It's happening. Go. <laughs> they Starting got it wrong. Soon? <laughs> how they about now? Just, just, so this is 45 minutes. Yeah, apparently. apparently. Mojang. I just saw Mojang. Do you remember for years everyone was like, oh no, actually it's Mojang. Yeah, yeah. And it's, it's not, <laughs> it's Mojang. Shut up. People who work there call <laughs> yeah, it Mojang. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm surprised you weren't one of those people. No, me too. <laughs> me too. <laughs> <laughs> like something you would say. I mean, given the opportunity, I probably would have been. It just never came up. And it was like, oh, good. It turns out it's oh, actually yeah. Mojang. Thank God I never had a chance to correct anyone. Nelson <laughs> Blunt says, Dave, James, you're really upsetting the kids. <laughs> <laughs> the kids should know by now. It's our it's our gimmick. It's our USP. I mean, you keep saying that, but you know, it's it's hurtful. Well, fuck off then. <laughs> fuck off. Fuck you. Oh, Dragging oh, you along oh. for the ride, and now you're moaning about it. <laughs> oh, look at look at them 18s. We're going to see some wow, saucy business. Yeah. Oh, I wonder if we'll see it go in, Sean. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> oh, it's cars. Here we go. Oh, no, hang on. No, it's all. It's look, Zelda Scrolls. It's, all right. Everything's yeah, it's going just, on, mate. We're going to see any on, 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 on skateboards. There. There's a guy there. I don't know if you noticed. He was wearing a blazer and jeans and a t-shirt. So I watch out. Ones on state on skateboards. You know, like they're <laughs> Sorry, Phil. I'll turn it up. Any office that looks fun to work at is dangerous. I've decided that now. Oh, it, all, realized, David, it always ends in tears. On, yeah. this is be They're out to get you. Audio, They're out to get you. That's all it means. They want every dark bit of your fucking time. <laughs> yeah, sorry about the echo. Should be sorted now. Wicked, right? Let's go. Come on, Xbox. You could do this. Come on, Xbox. That was a very good little pose. I hope that guy came up with that himself. Here we go. I Come hope on. he went to the thing. I was thinking I could walk up to the camera and go. Yeah, and I hope they yes, also do like cool a, a, a click. Welcome to Xbox Direct. Five <laughs> big games. Five big games. Okay, so it's okay, so the expecting. okay, so the Tango Game Works thing is happening then. All right. Fine. <laughs> is this one where you're going to ship paint, Sean? <laughs> yes. <laughs> paint. I genuinely thought that's what that said, <laughs> and then I just thought, is that some weird thing that I'm not aware of these days? <laughs> right, let's. I'm going to turn this up. Let's see what Dennis has got to say for himself. Multiplayer experience for the game. Minecraft Legends is a new action strategy game set in a lush, dynamic world. It introduces epic storytelling. Right. So, and you can form Minecraft Legends, new this is the first release of this. This isn't like a sequel or a follow-up. No, this is a new thing. We had Minecraft Legends Minecraft with a new play. Play. And what is it ripping off this time? Well, I was saying to James, I, it looks a lot like Kessen, which were these sort of Dynasty Warrior spin-offs. Right. But they're a bit more strategic, but where you're riding around on a horse. Right, let's have a listen, listen, listen then. The game will support cross have a listen, listen. play and online matchmaking. In order to create the best possible experience, we've partnered with Blackbird Interactive to develop the game. And it's been wonderful Blimey, to see yeah. their commitment and focus get them sold, on the Minecraft it? universe. No. It's so much fun to be Make working with my Studios my on Minecraft my Legends. <laughs> Here at Blackbird no, Interactive, no. we have a talented team of developers who are using right, our background in strategy oh, games to bring a new and exciting experience to the Minecraft universe. We're super excited to share more details about PvP gameplay. We'll tell you face. <laughs> <laughs> there are some really cool features that make PvP unique. First off, so players share their army and resources with their team. To, yeah, so this change. means that uh, individual so players aren't able right to win on their own. Tell your face. To be successful. <laughs> Communication is really important, and you can sort of really tell the teams that gel together because they naturally form roles at the beginning of the game. And yeah. as soon as we start, you're off collecting. <laughs> I start building. Yeah. We already we have our favorite roles, but we change them up. 
I really also, like the look of this. The world in PvP is procedurally generated. Right. Yeah, I'm trying Just to see like all the various campaign. games it's trying this to combine means that into each one. PvP session I like the idea of like, because it looks like, yeah, so some people can focus on like the fighting play. or ordering Depending stuff around, some people can focus on building. Generated, I don't know, it looks quite good. Cross platform's good. It's not going to look like that on the Switch though. No. I'm sick of people complaining about. Um, performance PvP. issues on the, the Switch, James. It's lives. annoying, isn't it? It's really, really annoying. Really is. Yeah, it's yeah. Yeah. It's how dare what they? anyone ever talks about. Just talk about they? the game. You, about you know? Please. <laughs> In PvP, it does look good, there's something it? for everyone. Mm. For players who like action, they can go attack the piglins or lay siege to the enemy base. For players who enjoy exploration, they can search the world to find resources for their team, hidden treasure chests, or scout the enemy base. Gathering resources to help the team out, that's super important. But whenever I get into a PvP match, the first thing I try to do is to track down the Regal Tiger. It's my favorite mob to ride because it's really fast, but it's also really cute. For players who like building, you can spend your time building defenses and upgrading your base because soon enough your enemy oh, will attack is this and you need to be ready. No, I think this is just the PvP mode that talks so about. The first thing yeah, that's what we're talking about now, yeah. Oh man, actually this might be... If you can bases, have one world... First thing I build like a persistent world, yeah. Yeah, like a persistent tower, world. Mm. Like having... Just playing a game with just me and Harry and just the enemy. Yeah, doing man. all this stuff. So I, really pride myself I was just in <laughs> imagine us doing a multiplayer you know, game, you guys all out fighting and you come back and I'm like, Lads, look, I've built a little bakery. And this is like like a village square, it's like a waterfall. Right, right. The goblins uh, are coming, you stupid After that, you can add whatever you want. <laughs> <laughs> it with the can we have some bread then? Because we all need health. Oh no, we've not made any bread yet. <laughs> so it doesn't actually work. It just lo like looks good though. And then once those walls are up, I like to actually hide my ice hey, traps behind them to catch enemies off guard. Chat. That is a good suggestion. When it suggestion. comes time to finally take out the other team, Bang, my go. favorite strategy is to make a forward camp just outside the enemy base. Then I get the biggest, strongest mobs I can as fast this as I can. This looks decent, actually. Yeah, it does look fun. It's just good. Then I can smash down the walls, take out their mobs, and claim victory. I think Ash will be quite excited by this. Yeah, same with Harry. <laughs> Do you feel like there's an element of like, because obviously we saw this like what six months ago and sort of glossed over it, and now it's like, well, there's no other games coming out really. So let's have another look at that Minecraft game. Is it left in the drawers? We got anything left in the cupboards? <laughs> Super noodles and Frankfurt. Sorry, I keep turning it down because of our top tier chat, mate. And then you, you soon, you soon Apologies. find out very quickly. Resources or do you want to go? I don't know. It's not the best uh, first time uh, chat, is it? A while back, uh, we had somebody that Why are you guys talking over a where they built video a where it clearly says talks homes. over in the bottom left hand archers. corner? What's that so all about? They're very weak, but they do a high amount of damage. And he had 40 of them, and he just ran through our base, ran around our tower, and took out our entire tower with such a simple strategy. And that's why we still love playing it every day, because every game is different, and you never know what's going to happen. Oh wait, no, do you have that auto dip thing? No, nope. turn it off. I've been manual dip. Oh, I can't, we can't. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> this does look really decent, you know. Yeah. Is it free to play? Well, it'll be on okay. Game Pass, won't it? So, yeah. Of course it will. Yes. Right. Quite soon. This is not too far at all. Shall I show that? Pre order or. Ooh, don't no bother. switch. This is <laughs> yeah, pre order. There was no switch there. Really? No, there wasn't. Yeah. There. Xbox, PC, and uh, I think it's a PlayStation as well, but no switch. Mm. Hey, here we go. I'm looking forward to seeing this. Are oh, you, though? Know. Yeah, I've never played a full uh, motorsport game, and I want to see how good this looks graphically. I'm Chris Osaki, and welcome to Turn Ten. Not good, but it's just not what the I like. Yeah. Well, I suppose I got into Gran Turismo. The next generation of Forza <laughs> Motorsport, <laughs> built from the ground up to take advantage of the Xbox Series consoles. This is the most technically advanced racing game ever made. Today. I'm joined by some of our amazing team members to show oh, you the game how it's coming to Switch. Real, sound real, and feel real. Someone tells me you're this not interested in this game, James. 
It's, it doesn't count, does it? You know. <laughs> <laughs> this counts. The last what was the last Falls of Motorsport? That was About years two ago. years ago, wasn't it? No. <laughs> Which one's this? Forza Motorsport five. features over 500 Six, cars for you to collect, race, and customize with more than 800 unique upgrades. This includes over 100 new to motorsport cars, the most modern race cars we've ever featured on our roster. Racing is violent. This it's is a battle good, on good the point. Track. I mean, is the Titanic going to be in this life? <laughs> are greater Probably than not. Motorsport 5, 6, it's only in the and ending sequence. 7 combined. This makes our driving experience more fun and yeah, so this is the last one come out, the last one, James, come out six years ago. I think it's because it just feels like there's a Forza coming out every year. I don't know why. It just feels like that. These are completely different games. I know they are, but it's still Forza, you know? Right. It's still a racing game from my And there's one every day, every year, pretty much. Respect. Yakuza. This yields a paint model that has a much more no, realistic not, light response. This isn't a competition, color, I'm just stating a fact. <laughs> Damn, the new Forza game comes out every year. Unique to each yeah, car. Facts, apparently. It's now contextually aware and more localized. We simulate paint thickness, chipping, and directionality. Okay. Dirt accumulation is more realistic, I gathering more in the low pressure areas like yes. recesses and alcoves. These so they say is, is ray tracing the in the word during the race, race or just Yeah, I think we knew that already, right? No, I thought it was just what I said. in those like, oh, this is our no, best sounding Watson, that was the horizon, yeah. And the first to be mixed natively for immersive audio formats like Windows Sonic and Dolby. Oh, there's a ghost doing the other faders then. <laughs> 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 oh, the we hired a ghost to help us with the audio on this game. For our players. Modifying car parts did a good like your exhaust and turbo changed the car sounds in Forza Motorsport, just like it would in the real world. Every car now has a variety of sound possibilities based on the parts you've installed. Hardware accelerated convolution reverb actually I do fucking love that. sounds and forces that interact within an acoustic space. Oh, dynamically back, adapting to its surroundings thing. and creating a realistic and detailed sound. You missed a ghost, Major PDD. <laughs> Like our regional this sounded like system, someone farting. An improved it did. Yeah. Audio bring Dude, new ours. Of realism to the game. I can never see how a cos work in this. Never before. Yes. Every tire squeal, every engine, lap after lap. Forza Motorsport. It's an unnecessary shot there. Yeah, we'll get away with it. Weird. We'll <laughs> for this generation. I think he You'll demanded they do that. Yeah. Fan favorites, it, as well Arthur, as five we don't want to put that in. Put it in. Put it in. Including our first in South Africa. want to look like a rock Kyle star. James is asleep, we I think. We capture our environment <laughs> to an incredible level of detail. When we reference a track, them. our team comes back with over three Sick. terabytes of highly detailed photogrammetry <laughs> and laser scan data. Do you, do you think the Three rest of us want to be here, James? Consoles, <laughs> we're able to use this data to draw up to Come 10 on, times more detail than previous generations. You'll see lush trees, dense grass, and overgrowth vegetation. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? Animated track life, what? physically based what lighting, and volumetric fire, fire emblem, and a fully James, you can't out check out this kind of fucking. Could, what's the matter with you? Look alive, <laughs> sound alive, and feel alive with cutting edge visuals. Kick him off the call if he does that again. <laughs> <laughs> so you're always immersed in the pure spectacle of racing. For the first time in Forza Motorsport, fully dynamic time of day with weather ensures a constantly evolving racing experience. Sorry, with weather? No two laps with weather. Ever look the same. Meanwhile, dynamic track temperatures, a with wet driving weather. surfaces, yeah. and the breeze <laughs> ensure that no two laps ever <laughs> It's like, whatever in my family calls bad weather I with weather. I love weather. the so... detail our talented team of artists <laughs> built into Kailan. <laughs> Fast forward to yeah, this looks and the vista fucking great. Is truly breathtaking. <laughs> Does look you can very see impressive. The distant night race is going to be amazing. City, a beautiful visual I'm touch. definitely going to rewatch this in 4K later. Even the Kailami later. logo itself yeah. creates visual Hands impact off. every not. time you see it. <laughs> thanks to ray trace global illumination. <laughs> we rewatch it again <laughs> and ignore <laughs> it again. I'm so <laughs> yeah. it's as they bounce off the call. The first time. We're rendering all our environments in 4K. We're like 15 minutes in, James already checks out. With real time ray tracing on track to create true to life reflections. Wow, look at that. Yeah, no, it's like you in a minute. With the incredible detail and rendering features of our track environments, Forza Motorsport is truly a generational leap ahead 
with unmatched I love the f I love the fact that he defended the Titanic intro to Gran Turismo and he's looking at this and going, oh, so boring. <laughs> so <laughs> yeah, exactly. The Titanic intro Warsome was something new and interesting. Back. This and is exactly the same. More, more of the same. <laughs> I, I give it. It was new. I don't know about interesting, James. <laughs> At least it had some something about it, you know, trying to no, do I something rather than just this. like, oh, let's in do the same thing again. But it looks nicer. Racing mode, you know. And in our all new <laughs> car building, <laughs> full of shit. Such a fanboy. We cannot wait for you to get your hands. What's the online mode? Yeah, didn't really get into that, did you? I wonder if it's still got all the Top Gear stuff in it. I was, <laughs> I was about to say, yeah, I, I mean, I, I reckon the online, online mode might be everyone races around a track and then whoever comes first wins. <laughs> yeah. <and that's>... yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's coming Maybe that's why they didn't get into it. <laughs> all right, that was that then. Okay, we're doing all right. We're Hello, oh, oh, we're on it? Tango. Fucking hell. Okay. Strap right, in. So this is a completely new game then. It is. Yeah. Yeah. Right, let's go. I also oh, get in! It is a daft action game. Yep, that's me. And you're probably one of the people. Well, it's pretty standard. <laughs> they did that on purpose, sure. They, yeah, I know. I know. I'm gonna turn this off a bit. Check right this out. Music player in my chest. It's powering up my new robot arm. <laughs> it's making everything sync up with the beat. Let's rock. This is awesome! Yeah, it's it. Come on, that's right! Hey. That's our Sun Sound drawing. Yeah. How's that last that first shot reminded me of? Massively. Ooh. What are we looking at? The name's Chai. As long as this is not, not an defect. arena battle, that's the guy. Oh. We'll take down this company. One boss at a time. Just so you know. This looks Aaron's good. It does. Rockstar. High five, Rush. That looks fucking great. Mm -hmm. Future Rockstar. I'm Shinji yep. Mikami, In. studio head at is. Tang Game Works. Well, Thank you for yeah, all your because support. So ever since years, Shinji Mikami John left um, director on High Five Platinum Rush. and then made Tango Gameworks, all he's done is horror games, which is fine. Yeah, so, but this to happen is amazing. Yeah, because <clears throat> I'm like, oh, well, I, I miss like Vanquish and stuff, right? Whereas, I mean, this doesn't look very Vanquish, but it looks fucking nuts. So everyone thinks of us as putting out horror games like The Evil Within or spooky games like Ghostwire Tokyo, but this is clearly something totally different. And if this game hasn't already no. leaked, fingers <laughs> crossed, goes, no, that is just we hope first it's a surprise. <laughs> <laughs> We're lulling the fire into some sense of security. <laughs> <laughs> and then, uh, we found all this code from Sunset Overdrive <laughs> just sitting on a hard drive somewhere. But the team is all so I don't need the captions on this. So we've been waiting for this for a long time. Well, now we do. So let's jump in and explain exactly what Hi-Fi Rush is. You watch a lot of people complain about that attitude rhythm action of the character. So it's a bit of a twist in the tradition. Uh, Here, your moves and attacks chat, help though. create if a living sound. If it was Deadpool, you'd all be pissing. all your flashy moves, <laughs> stylish and devastating combos add a layer to the music. The more you flow with the beat, the better you can connect your attacks and abilities. Yes, mate. You are in total control during combat, but everything you do syncs up like this an awesome look really video. Close. That's High Five Rush. It's like a Dreamcast game, I think. Mm. Yeah, it yeah, really does. Play as Chai. A wannabe rock star. <laughs> it looks like that Dreamcast game, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I was thinking about today, Matt? Virtual on. Yeah, yeah man. Virtual on. You can play that on your Xbox Series X, man. That was that, okay. As you can see, that was a giant. Was it a giant robot fighting game? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mech. Mech. yeah the uh, the the Xbox Live Arcade version works fine on your your series console. Really? Yeah, yeah. Ooh, I might have to look into that. However, attacking on the beat leads to combos that end with a musical countdown. We call a beat. I won't. Think a big cymbal crash at the end of a drum solo. Too much like on. This. 
We call it beat hit. Landing beat hits unleash a combo finish that adds unique musical flair and high damage attacks. And the crowd goes wild. I mean, I'm gonna suck at this, but I'm gonna really enjoy trying to figure it out. <laughs> See the guy that did this? <laughs> <laughs> we do love a bit of humor on this show, and it. that was humor. He did it. <laughs> he did it. <laughs> oh, did he? Yeah. Oh, oh I see. Yeah, oh, he no. did it. He did that. That's good. Stuff. I mean, I know what Sarah means in the chat, like about how you know not being able to get into a rhythm action game if you don't like the music. But I'm not sure because, like, Owen Dan, for example, had loads of music that I would never have gone for, and then you end up finding it's amazing actually. You know, because yeah, it makes you appreciate the music. And yeah, I mean, Beat Saber. I love Beat Saber. I've never listened to any of the Beat Saber songs outside of Beat Saber because I would not enjoy them. But you get rewarded musically and mechanically for staying in rhythm. Oh, frequency as well is full of music that I yeah, would yeah, never yeah. normally listen yeah, to. Sorry, Sarah, it sounds like we've taken well, your we point and absolutely shat on it. Sorry. Yeah, yeah Sarah's got a point, but also. Here's <laughs> 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 another. This is all these counter examples. <laughs> what a couple of arseholes. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know, for a minute then, I looked down at our view account and it said 25,990 and I thought, fuck it, we've exploded and realised I just had the wrong figure. You could have done this, wait, this is blown up. <laughs> no, Cammy, I know Freebird's on Beat Saber, but, that, but that's, I'm talking about like the original tracks. Do not like any of them. Literally. Get up, slacker. We've got work to do. Chai will team up with unlikely allies to expand his repertoire of moves both in and out of combat. There's Peppermint breaking barriers and juggling enemies, along with Macaron smashing enemy armor and knocking back enemies. Tag teaming with Chai's partners and attacks opens up huge... Uh, if they nail this, this could be over the top action. proper, couldn't it? Yeah. Right, what we yeah, think... If the, if the rhythm and everything is good, it'll feel amazing. Like, it's going to be this year one. It's got to be this, this year, looks right? pretty... The extra help well, I'm hoping yeah, for it's coming as a lot. Yeah. Be running around and wreaking havoc all over Vandalay's corporate headquarters, where everything. Is oh, please don't be rubbish or niggling. <laughs> please be a <laughs> fucking nine or a ten. <laughs> Taking down the boss. Please. Vandalay Technologies. Besides wanting to erase Chai for being a. This is quite a sizable video, isn't it? It is. Yeah. Vandalay Technologies. That's agenda. quite funny. You'll fight through each department Go to on. take them all on. It's the Vandalay Industries, isn't it? Seinfeld. On the rock yeah. Oh! <laughs> and then, we have a showdown. So I'm not, I, I, I'm aware I should be, but I'm not a big Seinfeld guy. So let's get ready. It's, not, it's just one I've, not, I've never really Boss delved into. Boss battles are climactic set pieces. Very good. Straight up fights in musical minigames to chase sequences. Custom choreographed to licensed music from a Manage now's artist. black keys, prodigy. Oh shit. Oh, there's Zwan? Yes. Yeah, Zwan. Good. Fucking what? Zwan are in it. What? Hi five Zwan. Zwan. Jesus Zwan Christ. <laughs> <And there's> <laughs> one, <laughs> one, one album. And then just disappeared. Who's <laughs> 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 <It's, you know, laughs> Zwan? What have they done that Who's I know? Billy Corgan from Smashing Pumpkins. It was his. Yeah. Right, oh, 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 okay, I mean, yeah. he's gone a bit info wars now, but. It was a good album, that was. I enjoyed it. Fucking Zwan. Zwan. I know it's funny to say Zwan. But that's weird. That's really weird. Yeah, I'm going to say first half of the year. I'm going to say second half of the year. Oh, I think it's the second half of the year. I'm going to say second half of the year. I'm going to say second half of the year. You can have a pet cat. Oh, sorry, Sean. Well, I'm not going to fucking play it now. What a fucking shit game. Sorry, <laughs> oh, hell, are they going to say it's out now? So, not only are we super psyched for you to play this, nah. we're happy to tell you that you can play Hi Fi Rush tonight. Holy shit! Not a demo, <laughs> not a full game. <laughs> Amazing. It launches on Xbox and PC. <laughs> yes, I did. The show, well. And yes, it'll be a wow. as well. I'm going to say second half <laughs> of the year, <laughs> Matt. <laughs> <laughs> I can switch my Xbox on. That's amazing. Get in. Holy fuck. Oh my god, I've got to play more for Spoken. 
so glad that I'm in a bit of a lull at the moment with nothing to play. Yeah, I'm so, so glad I just bought for Spokens. <laughs> To the end of insert this. I mean, I have five. Screwdriver up my nose. That is brilliant. <laughs> I, I love a, a stealth <laughs> release. Yeah. No, this. I don't think there's any stealth in this. I think it's. You can run through it. it. Mainly action. You can just run through it. It's, uh... Come on. I did a stealth section in Forsaken Spoken last night, and I just followed oh, the yeah. character. Yeah, it didn't let me walk out into the. Oh, amazing. <laughs> I saw the bit with yeah that you with the, the money. It's like pick pick up the money and it's like no. Nah, Out not today. Do that. That's not mad. Work. That is mad. That is very That's cool. mad. Happy with that. I, I still think there's actually gonna be a six game. Oh, oh, I now we're picking up lads. Elder Scrolls. Oh, I don't care for this. <laughs> I know. <he's> going to... <laughs> Is Obliv Oblivion Zelda Scrolls, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, it's interesting listening to those old podcasts where they're just coming to well, terms with Oblivion. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Of Zenimax Online Studio. I, mean, I remember the time when it came out, that, it was a big deal, Scrolls Oblivion. Because it, it was, but everyone was skeptical of it until about a month into it, when everyone was like, no, this really is absolutely June, fucking unbelievable. Yeah. Oblivion really was. I, mean, I know everyone loved ever. Skyrim. I didn't get on with it. You saw that Necrom will include one of the no, most requested here. features in the I have tried to play Elder Scrolls online, but I you. called the Arcanist. It's fine. It's only our third new class since launch. The first one of those I ever played was Daggerfall. The Arcanist oh, yeah, that was, magic that was also very good when I was that age, but also incredibly buggy mm, and really broken. Like oh, sorry, guys. Forest. Everyone says, uh, Scientology just says that these games suck, so let's just stop talking about Elder Scrolls then. will unfold in Eastern Morrowind. Not seen in an Elder Scrolls game since 19. Because it was made in the West, Ben. You will meet new characters and enemies, reunite with some old friends. I mean, that looks incredible. Look at that. Based around the no, it doesn't. Well-known Daedric Prince, <laughs> you just might remember from the Dragonborn Skyrim DLC. For those of you oh, in the ESO, we release a new expansion called a Chapter every year. Chapters are essentially standalone games in ESO that let you adventure in a new region of Tamriel. When's this other game out? Is it out like to now? Now? Chapter to can we download in. it? Uh, it's 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 so you can enjoy yeah. right now. If you love games uh, like Skyrim <coughs> Oblivion, which is, feel right I mean, obviously, like, the, the game kind of leaked. It, a bit of it leaked, as in there is going to be a Tango. Uh, you know, yeah, so we need game. the title. The fact they kept it under wraps, leaked, you know, release, releasing today is awesome. Mm. That is very good. Alley Oak, thank you for the subscription. We've got an entire oh, I thought you said Ali A. I was like, blimey. <laughs> if you were capable of taking but I appreciate you, Ali A. Try it for yourself in ESO. Hey, what's up? You visited a city Zekno in TV. Zekno Telly. The shell of a hey all. Crab. For the Oblivion fans out there. How about another chance at taking on the colossal Daedric Prince, Mehrunes Dagon? Yeah, that hi-fi game is oh, not no, on the not story yet. Just like again. any single-player Elder Scrolls game, you can have a blast simply by following the main quest line. Or seek out lore and learn more about the world. Become a craftsman. You see, because this is what sort of intrigued me about Elder Scrolls Online, is basically what we just said. Home. is like, you can just follow the story Customize and not even yeah. really care about no, it being an like MMO. An but you're still hampered by all the... When you're the, ready, the, the tech MMO that needs to make it, and yeah, like still feels like an MMO. See that? That's the thing that put me off. You know, Knights of the Old Republic. How that? Yes. You know, they, obviously, there's the MMO of that, and it's like I really wanted to see how that story continues mm -hmm. after the second game. Yeah. But it's like I just don't. I don't think it. I know you can play it single player or whatever, but I don't. If not the most. Yeah, but you know that happens. The most stuff will actually affect it. You may be able to get through it without that. No, but yeah, it still will have that thing where there's like an interface with like a billion key bindings yeah, and things like that. Yeah, it's still gonna look and feel like an MMO because even yeah. if you're not with other people, you're still in an within an infrastructure that's built to support that. Yeah, and it's just not the same. It'll be like you know, like a million windows for like different things and like key yeah. bindings and yeah. all sorts of stuff. Mick Marmalade, thank you for the sub. Thank you, Mick Marmalade. Look what Marmalade. Not, it, not into Marmalade personally. Sorry, Mick. Oh, don't you? Oh, man, I'm a jam what, what are you doing? Are you? You're allowed to play with your phone or whatever during a boring bit, but I'm not. I can announce it's on the store. Uh, you were literally today, playing another game. Time, um, Sean, yes. where do you sit on Honey? Oh, I love it. 
So yeah, everyone I'm never a fan of that either. Well, adventures, including our take what's wrong with money? Pretty <laughs> DLCs! Yeah, yeah man, it's not, not into it. More. <clears throat> At Zoss, we have so many DLCs and talented developers who continue to I've never been comfortable with the pluralization of DLC epic like that. adventures. Downloadable content. Yeah, because you would yeah, you would say content. You just have also, more content. Also, DLC stands for something, so the S DLCs. No, yeah, I don't really work with it. Ooh. for the 2023 ESO global reveal where we'll go deep into all things. Yeah, see, it says launches tonight. Thanks. Hang on, wait, oh, what have you done to upset Digifolio? He says he's on subbing. What what happened? Hey, Cammy subbed as well. Cheers, Cam. Cheers, Cammy. Cocker me. Oh, is it because is it of the marmalade stuff? Oh, right, okay, yeah. I don't know. Right, last game, last game, we got 15 minutes, so I think you might be right, Matt. No, Something downloadable yeah, content doesn't work, so because you don't go, here is a content, here is another <laughs> content. You just go, here is an amount of content. <laughs> but then also, as Grey Dragonclaw says, multiple DLC doesn't sound right either. It's too late. It's got multiple DLC. Yeah. It's just Some more DLC. DLC. Yeah. Additional DLC. Anyway, this is this is gonna be good. Right, shush, everyone be quiet. This is what we're here for. Yeah. This game is about. Welcome to Redfall, Massachusetts, where the calm seas and sunny skies have been eclipsed by a legion of vampires. Redfall is a story-driven shooter at its heart, which can be played single player or co-op with up to four players. Choose your oh, hero, each with their yeah, own unique too. abilities, oh, want me and form some the perfect action. vampire slaying squad to take back Redfall's haunted. How good was that day when we were hammering Left 4 Dead? Those good days up. At Arcane, we make yeah. games where the you world itself that, though, is as you? important as the characters. Yeah, I did, but I still play for playing with the game. With Redfall, we take an exciting Spectre. step forward, building a Just lovingly detailed right open world to deliver our largest setting ever. That's why uh, Back for Blood was such a disappointment. Every inch of our open world is carefully never handcrafted and packed with environmental stories. It's ridiculously difficult, even on like just easy or whatever. It was just, well, I don't think, From the I think we only ever finished downtown, like one of the maps. Forest, and it was just the decimated not fun. Seaside boardwalk mm. and Shame. gorgeously detailed land. Right, everyone's telling, everyone's telling us, shut up. <laughs> they introduced all like, the calm system. But it's not all danger all the time. There are safe places on the island where you can rest up, chat with survivors and resupply. So it, this is open world. Here we're at the fire station, one of your home bases. I think they're hubs. This right? is one place you'll Biles. receive missions from survivors. Bio. There's something I need you to do. The old lighthouse in the bay. I love it's the been idea used for of over a century to keep boats so away from the coastline. And then telling it's the people to back be on. quiet. <laughs> it's a warning to anyone trying to come to Redfall right now. Easy, right? Well, the lighthouse Hopes keeper is a real asshole. Stars. Joined up with those cultists and took the damn lamp with him. Sorry about your season so far. Go on, Bird. Hold the last 20. Here's a vampire known as the Shroud. Shrouds blanket the area in darkness, disorienting their prey. They hurl lethal projectiles and can even shift through the floor to avoid damage. They're not looking down iron sights or anything. Bam. Is this going to be last gen as well, or is it? Don't know. Okay, next. Uh oh. Does look a bit spooky, mate. <laughs> no, it's scary writing, and I don't, I don't think that's paint, guys. I think what? it might be something else. What, not decorate. Yeah. what game did that? Oh, I remember that. Do you remember that, Jack? Oh, right. oh, it was paint. It, it was, was paint. paint. Yeah. Oh. Did you see that? Yeah. <laughs> it's paint on the floor. Yeah. <laughs> that was good. Shut you up, Sean. Sure. <laughs> I did. I might leave. <laughs> might leave now. I'm going home now. I'm going home now. <laughs> I can't tell you how many times I've The lighthouse <laughs> is back up, but there's nice. more waiting for you. We did it. 
Taking down vampires angers the vampire gods, who will summon the Rook to take you down. Not the Rook. Here he is, though. Let's transition to what you'll find outside of the main story missions. There's so much waiting for you. Redfall is filled with encounters that can pop up anywhere, like this brewery that's fallen under cultist control. Save the locals from being offered to the vampires. Like our past games, you can approach a mission in many different ways. Gary's right, this does look a bit like Time Splitters. Mm. Well, visually. Does yeah. look very time splitters. Always be ready to improvise. <laughs> Remy uses her combat robot Brebon to help distract and eliminate the cultists. We got him, Brebon. More paint. I love how demos work like this. So the way they look around, you never look around like this in a game. <laughs> no. Here. No. Never, I've never done that before. It's a skill in and of itself. I think. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> oh, slowly panning round. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's quite lovely. I mean, this looks like great fun. It does. Yeah. Good. Everyone's safe. Let's move on. Bit of an abrupt ending to that bit, I must say. Beyond the yeah. Of yeah. As Everyone you investigate otherworldly psychic spaces, that's the, actually the ending of the, the game. Vampire secrets. <laughs> Take this vampire nest. These deadly layers change each time you step inside. <laughs> Jacob sends out his raven to tag the enemies below. Dev follows up with his teleporter, instantly closing the gap. See, the group that I play with, there's no way there's going to be teamwork like this going on. <laughs> <laughs> James, that's James uh, just saying he's not going to play to with us. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Escape the nest before it comes crashing down. It'll collapse any second. This stuff is always very confusing to me because mm. it's, not, it's like they're trying to show you how the game works, but this, all this stuff is clearly you need to see in context. Nests and, aren't the only yeah, yeah. So it's not really yeah. telling you anything, is it? Dangerous pockets all over the island. Just showing that there's a lot it's of things to see and do. Yeah. So yeah. Tread carefully. <laughs> this so, could be a lot of fun. Vasari in the chat says, "James, are you the alpha of your group?" <laughs> it's, to be fair, it doesn't take much to be the alpha of our group. <laughs> Outside the main story, I assume he means the other group. Yeah, yeah, yeah secret friends. No, oh, right. Oh, okay. And the answer is yes. Safe houses hidden all over the island, and then work I don't know. Have you met Spencer? <laughs> that guy wears cowboy boots in 2023. <laughs> I'll never forget that, Dave. When he put those up on the on the, I didn't think I was going to stop laughing, and I, I thought my head was going to cave in. It was the lady at the um, uh, the bowling alley that just looked at him as if to go, "What the fuck?" Here, Layla's lift ability can be upgraded to launch teammates for airborne attacks. Upgrade Layla's umbrella ability with bullet hail to absorb enemy bullets and release the energy back at them. This looks like a lot of fun. Does definitely. This definitely, definitely got more excited than uh, oh, the next five minutes are going to be spent on this. <laughs> Hello, John Tempelli! John Tempelli, who's, who's actually probably just got out of bed, right? Phone house! 
It has been a good show. It's, good. Yeah, it's a shame it's there's not more magic. surprises. Yeah. Not more new but stuff. No, there's still chance. There's there's a wide range of there is still chance. Rick mm. Star 32. From shotguns to sniper rifles. Sub in. What a legend. Rick Star. Well, well. And of course, if this hasn't got crafting picks. or card games Find in it, I'll be all over this. Weapons. I think it'd be brilliant. It's got customization. Mm, it's not crafting, crafting though. Yeah. Oh, Phil Wall's guessing a Skyfall announcement. Of Skyfall. The last step is to face the I mean, Star controls. Skyfall. Used to control As in James Bond. <clears throat> I mean, yeah, Starfield. I mean, That's good. The vampire gods, with their yeah, they're, they're, here's again. They're, they're, they're going to announce a delay at the end of this. <laughs> so <it's already> <laughs> yeah, Coco, that 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 is, that is the best surprise. The yeah. But what we're saying is that that's the only one. A skull that gets you one step closer. That's still more than we've had out of a Nintendo red. Direct for the a very long time. <laughs> so that's very true. We've got to be due one of those some point soon, right? Uh, yeah. When they announce all thank this new um, Mario Odyssey and content, thank you for mm. all the support <laughs> you've shown Arcane throughout the years. We sometimes joke look a bit that like our messy. games can be tough to define. The one thing that's consistent. We make the kinds yeah, I wonder of games when the, we uh, love there to Zelda, that. and that's <laughs> our <laughs> <red> <laughs> 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 We blended everything we love here at Arcane Austin: immersive open worlds, unique and customizable heroes, RPG and FPS gameplay, and of course our signature storytelling messy, and messy. world building. Along with our spin on one of the most classic monsters of all time. Just having a lot of messy. Vampires. Just play. It's been amazing to see how all of us have pulled together to deliver our vision for something new. Did they say vampires? I thought she yeah, most yeah, ambitious game we have ever made. Our teams dove head first into this new opportunity, and we can't wait for you to experience Redfall for yourself. Thankfully, you won't have to wait too much longer. Redfall's yes, coming on May did second. they shoot that way? May! Yeah, that, to get May. that depth of field with and such we'll a wide shot. That's May. nuts. Yeah, May is not far away. Sight. Back. May. So, all of, so obviously Forza is um, is just later this year, but all the rest yeah, of Yeah, that would be towards yeah. November time, usually. Mm. Those games come out at the end of the year. Mm. So they've got, so they've got this, then, so there'll be Starfield, probably, and then Forza as well. That's not a bad year. Not a bad lineup, is it? Yeah. Mm. I mean, all these games apart from Forza are the first half of the year as well. Mm. <clears throat> right. So that is current that's gen it. only as well, yeah. Like, uh... Will there be one more thing, mate? There isn't. Will there be it? Oh, hello. Outro no, sizzle. Yeah. Oh, it's just going to be the same. Oh, it's the same. No, it's a sizzle reel. Yeah. Right, then. That looks fucking great. I can't wait to play that. Um, Forsaken review will probably come the week after. <laughs> <laughs> Forspoken. Sorry. Hello. So that's not a real world. It's so much fun to be working with Mojang Studios yeah, on Minecraft Legends. <laughs> <laughs> According to the first result I got, it's not a world. <laughs> This is our best sounding Forza Motorsport ever. Hello Alex, no they did not show Fable. I think it's probably best to assume yeah, we ain't seeing that. I mean, I was surprised we got to see Perfect Dark. You know, like, uh, it's well, yeah, did we? I mean, development. Some of the best graphics I've ever seen in a video yeah. game. Oh, Chris Garrard, thank you. Oh, hi Chris. I used to work with Chris. Did you? Oh, Chris, tell us about Matt at work. Yeah, what's he like? Can you just put... Things in the chat about Matt, what Matt's like at work. Um, <laughs> well, we do we work in the same team, so. Uh, sure yeah, I'm but saying. the story's probably travelled. Oh, oh, it's a travel boy. Okay. That thing with the teeth at the end. <clears throat> yeah. That, that's the kind of thing I could imagine Dave persuading me to do. And him thinking it was really funny, but <laughs> nobody else thinking it was particularly funny. I don't care what anyone else thinks. <laughs> if I find it really funny, that's it. Okay, so that's the end of them, right? Okay, the main yeah. thing is that... Hold they on. Did... Oh, this would just be about the... Oh, yeah, the... it's going to be uh, Elder Scrolls Online. Yeah. Oh, boy. So the main thing is they did have a new format, and it was in, it was it was in a sensible time frame, and yeah. it was punchy, and it worked. Okay, right, let's get yep. right so, yeah, so yes, yes, as, as a presentation, that was good. 
It was yes. good. It was good. It's and I think the best thing they've done for a long time. They've yeah. finally learned what we want, and it's it's still pretty long compared to like a direct or a state of play. And obviously, the full game is out tonight, John Tempelli. The full game is out tonight. Yeah. Yeah. Full game out tonight. Yes, yeah, obviously full longer game out than tonight. a direct, sure. less games than a direct, but it's still way better than usual. And the full game. Yeah, it gets me excited for what they can do with this time format it's next. Just, just because it's not game. a demo. It's the full game. The full game. Literally full game. Yeah. yeah. Sorry, Matt. I was just saying, like you know, long in a direct, less games in a direct, but this yeah. is, they're finally learning this is the kind of format we need and want from this kind of thing. Tonight, yeah, tonight. Game. Sorry, Matt. <laughs> I think I've said it enough now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I mean, it's, I prefer the shorter showings, but they, they only had, what, like six games to show in 45 minutes, so... Yeah. Yeah, it's you know, it is a shame we didn't see Starfield and some of the games they have announced that seem to have, you know, gone away, which is a bit of a shame. Um, but as you say, the lineup isn't too bad. I mean, it's certainly it's the best it's year. been for about four or five years for Xbox. Hang on, guys. Cammy's phoning me. Shall I put him on? Yeah. yeah. Go all on. right, one sec. Let's get him on speakerphone. You're right, Cammy. How's it going? This is Cockamy. Hey, uh, I'm just curious about something that you know a lot about games, so I just want to make, I want to ask you. Yeah. Yeah, see that new game, that uh, Wi-Fi Crush game? The Wi-Fi Crush game, yeah. Yeah. Is that out today? Is it the full game? That is, yeah. So just to confirm, everyone, it's the full game. It's not just the demo. It's not just a demo. Game. The full game is, is full out game. tonight. Yeah, yeah. Right, yeah. All right, cool. Thanks for letting me know. And no worries. I'll speak to you later. All right, nice. Full game. Take care. Full game. All right, bye. Yeah, if anyone's confused, it is the full game. Full right, game. okay. Tonight. Tonight, yeah. Full game. <clears throat> cool. So yeah, I thought that was good. That, that that was yeah the best showing I've had in ages, in a sensible running time. Yeah, and they did all something the very exciting first... that we all absolutely <laughs> by Zip. Jesus. <laughs> I might have to explain that to Cammy now when we're offline. Yeah, yeah, you're going to um, have to. Um, <laughs> right, okay. So, uh, yeah, I mean, it, it, whenever they, whenever you show a game that looks as good as that and says it's out now is just absolutely brilliant. So yeah, yeah. Um, stuff. let's hope it's good. Mm. Let's hope it's good because... I'm sure that, that certain people that work for certain magazines are on Twitter at the moment moaning that, well, we didn't get a copy, so that's never a good sign. <laughs> yeah, we can you imagine, like, if the, the show next week, we're just like, yeah, I've all played it. It's not very good. <laughs> right. 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 Are we done? Yeah. Oh, Alex. Alex, are you an hour behind? 